frustrated group. They've had plenty of chances tonight. I don't know how many times, James, they've rang one off the post there, and they just can't get back into the game. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. The Canadians will lose a man tripping the call. As soon as the hands go up when they start to plead with the ref, you know they know they're guilty. The Coyotes once again send out their power play unit. Montreal's got a hold of the puck. They've had a good night, but here's another opportunity to throw another one on the board. You don't get these nights very often. Hangs onto the puck. The Coyotes scoop it up along the boards. Dvorak's got it across the line. Strong defensive effort. Puck scooped up by Schmaltz. Quick feed to Deneau. Pokes the puck away. Nice zone entry from the right side. Puck dumped in deep, allowing for the defenseman to change. And he easily stops that one. Centered out in front. Again, the denial by the goaltender. Took Foley's out of the box, and both sides are back to even strength. Oh, well, their goaltender's going to be the happiest guy on the ice. Usually, as of late, when they get shorthanded, he just gets pounded in there. But the PK did a nice job, and they killed the penalty off. The Canadians gain control of the puck against the wall. Gains the zone from the right. Oh, great play to stay on the attack. Oh, well, now you can keep going. What a slithery move. Let's it go from the slot. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Kemper. High quality chance, high quality save. Centered out in front. Whoa. He scores. Talk about capitalizing there. They looked like they were more aggressive knowing that they were going to get a power play. You can take a chance. There's no risk of giving up anything against. The Canadians have been the busier team in the offensive zone, but they still trail in the third. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Moves it quickly over to Petrie. Slides the puck ahead to Hayden. Reads the play and forces the turnover. Great positioning by the defender. Right in the open ice, that one's picked off. Moved out in front, can't connect. The Coyotes have it against the wall. And now he passes up to Pitlick. And the always popular icing call made, and you know what that means, Ray. Now, offensive zone faceoff, man. He missed the play going down the ice, and that's a gimme icing. Now they can't change. You've got tired guys on the ice. The Coyotes take possession off the faceoff. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. They score! And showing a little signs of life on the ice. They also showed no quit. I mean, they were trailing by three. Now they've... Closed it a little bit. They've got to get another one to really feel good about themselves. Sneaks away with the puck after he was tangled up on the draw. The Coyotes look to start the transition game. He clearly doesn't like that. Just as one guy wants to fight, you don't have to. He says no way. Puck possession so critical. Another faceoff coming up here. Arizona's got possession here in their own end. Leobushkin's got it from behind his own net. That's broken up in the neutral zone. The Canadians have done a good job with their sticks, intercepting passes, yet they haven't been able to stretch this game out. And he elects to play the puck. From the left side, takes it at center. Big play inside the defensive zone. The Canadians carry it along the wall. Quick shot, misses a golden opportunity there. The Canadians have had more scoring chances than their opponents tonight. They're not able to cap. He scores! On the rebound, lights the lamp for the goal. Uh, goalie burps up this rebound here. It comes right back into the shooting area and the rebound is put away. Montreal's won the draw. Goal. Scored by number 92. Right out front, it's in, it's in, he scores! Well, he got some help from the goaltender. He couldn't find the puck, and as he goes to look for it, he shoves it into his own net. Time of the goal. Well, you want to be on the highlights, do you? You're going to be now. He puts it into his own goal.
The Canadians have essentially said to everybody, buckle up as they have even things up. You get into the last five minutes, it becomes a crap shoot in a tie game. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Goal. Scored by number two. Moves it to Toffoli. Couldn't complete the play. Scores! The deadlock's broken. That's a big goal, and they put him into the lead. Montreal's breathing a bit easier now here, coming up with a big goal in this third period. Their bench was pretty excited when that goal went into the net. Now they'll want to continue to be aggressive and don't let the opponent start to dictate the pace. Sends a pass over. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Almost lost. Well, he's calling him out now. The Canadians going to work on offense. Anderson's not so sure about the weight class here. He says no thanks. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. Quick pass to Toffoli, and that pass goes awry. Scooped up along the wall by Demers. The Coyotes move the puck in the defensive zone. It's a three-on-one. Scores! Wow, what a goal! Nice hands, great finish. Little short break, and it's in the net. Good thing he won times his puck. The goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot, and he beats him clean. Arizona's answered back here. in the third huge third period goal to tie things up they've really worked hard and deserve this spot in the game now we'll see at even do coaches really shorten their bench out and start double shifting guys can't catch up to the pass pokes it away here in the neutral zone the coyotes get a hold of the puck along the boards couldn't complete the play and they can't convert to the play here's a short pass to Lekanen Good defensive stop with the poke check. Oh, the poke check! What a read by the goaltender! The Coyotes take it across the line. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. Tosses it to Wheel. Looking to make something happen along the boards. What a steal in his own end! There's the horn to end period number three. Still deadlocked here. That means overtime is coming up. Our city. See the official arena website for details on upcoming concerts. The Canadiens have a little more room on the bench, and that's because their injured player is not going to return tonight. He was evaluated in the locker room, and the doctors are going to hold him out. Thanks for... He can end it here! Puts it to the front of the net! Oh, what a missed chance that was! Yeah, he's got a... He might have a step here! They've got the defense outnumbered. Slides it across! His reflexes on display tonight. Big stop by the keeper! Yeah, it's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. The Coyotes get a hold of the puck in their own end. Arizona's moving it along the wing. And that's just out of reach. There's the whistle icing the call. A critical draw here. Schmaltz quick on the draw. Arizona's got a hold of the puck. Quick feed to Schmaltz. He's got the game on his stick! Game on his stick! They 